Hello guys, welcome to Rishi Apps YouTube channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn how to create your own website with help of HTML and CSS. Okay, so in the last video, uh, it is a part one of this video. We are some, uh, somewhat like this, right? Okay. Today in this video, we are going to do a continuation of that video only. Okay, so in the last video, we have done this website. So welcome to your tour and we are glad that you are here. And HTML and like or what is HTML description? Okay, so let's uh start this video. So that we can go to Visual Studio Code and we can open that folder itself. Okay, let's do some designing like this. So let's do a more background call background image for the, our uh HTML website. Okay, so for that in the body in the body HTML CSS. So what are what you are going to do means let's create a background uh, image. Okay, background image. So which is a URL. So so I have already downloaded one Im image. So which is a mountain image. So let I can set that mountain image. So mountain.jpg. So and what I need to do means uh next first of all let's check that uh app. Okay. Okay, let's test that. Okay, let's go to your new app. Yes, we can see this image, right? But it's our six images now. So for converting into a full image as one image, what we are going to do means let's go to the same thing itself. So let's keep as background size as cover. Okay, because of that, the background size will be covered successfully. So let's reload it and we can see that as a one image. Okay, so let's what we are going to do next means go to, go to a visual studio code and let's uh, do a designing for H1 tag. Okay, H1 tag. So in the H1 tag, it should get a color i mean the font family so font family means the text uh, the size so i mean i mean the text style is going to be changed now okay so i'm going to set one style so now the text style was changed successfully so now we can keep one uh a text color okay for that we simply go to color color code and it is going the color is going to be white so after white and let's test our website so yes, we can see the we can see our uni author website, right? So why we can't able to see this uh uni author or alone? Why because it's because of the cloud. So what we can do means that we can uh, keep a car background color for that. So better we can we may also with any color like instead of white we can keep as orange, right? So orange. Yes, we can reload it. Yes, we can see this uh beautiful. Welcome to UniOtter that H1 tag, right? So next, and what we are going to do means we are going to do a styling for we are glad that you're here, okay? So let's go to Visual Studio Code and let's uh, design for H2. It's a H2 tag, okay? So let's design for H2 tag. So here, font family is going to same thing, okay? Font family is going to be same style, okay? Let's copy and paste the same code. Why? Because uh, this both are going to be in the same style only. So let's uh, go to our website and see. Yes, it's good, right? It's look good now. So let what I'm going to do means now I'm going to keep, uh, keep us uh, keep the background color. Okay, background color is going to be background color. So okay, background color. It's not coming. Yes. Background color, okay. Background color is going to be orange. So background color is going to be orange, and we can see. Go to our website and see means what will happen. As we can reload and see, yes, we can see this. Uh, welcome, welcome. Sorry, we are glad that you are here. And uh, the text uh, the color is going to be changed now. Okay, uh, the text color is going to be white. Or else we can also keep recently. We can leave like the white, black itself. So let's do a marquee tag for this. We are glad that you are here. Which is a h2 tag and uh, what is marquee tag marquee tag means nothing but the text will be coming from right side to left side okay like it will move okay so let's go to visual studio code and go to html document so inside this uh, first of all you need to make sure that inside this h2 tag really you should uh create that marquee tag and you are q u e marquee tag and we should uh we should uh, Close that marquee tag. After this, after this, we are glad that you are here. Okay, the text one. Okay, the 
let's uh, go to our website and reload and see. Yes, we can see that we are glad that you're here. This text is coming from right side to left side of our screen. Okay, so whenever this we are glad that you're here text was re successfully reached the left side means automatically another one text will create it and come from the right side to left side again and again. Okay, so whenever this it's going to touch this left side corner. So it was successfully touched means that time it is going to create another one text here. Okay. Yes, we can see another one text again. Okay, let's go to Visual Studio Code and we can design for a paragraph, right? So, paragraph is very simple. Okay, let's say uh, like the same thing only we need to go do, uh, to do. So, paragraph style, free means paragraph. So, paragraph font family, same thing. Font family is going to be same style only. Okay, let's copy and paste it again, both the codes. And the background color is going to be what means? Uh, tomato okay tomato color background color is pretty uh, tomato color and the text color it is color simply color is going to be white okay so uh, tomato and white yes let's reload and see yes we can see this uh, html description right so after this what we are going to do means we are going to add some videos out from our rishi apps youtube channel okay for that what we are going to do means let's go to rishi apps youtube channel and go to videos and here, what we are going to do means let's add our learn basic HTML for what one video itself. For that, so for, for that, what we are going to do means uh, we are going to click the share. So go to embed. So let's copy it. Now we'll copy the iframe code. So let's go to Visual Studio Code. So let's paste it on the HTML. Okay html document okay let's paste it here so let's keep that a uh, frame border is going to be so border is nothing but the border you know uh, the normal word itself so next what we're going to do means uh let's create some designing for that okay before that we we'll, let's check it's working or not okay let's reload and see for the unitor website as we can see that our uh, iframe right which is our youtube video and let's create some radius for this youtube videos uh so for that what we need to do means let's go to css and uh, let's create high frame here high frame style is going to be so high frame is going to be a border radius border radius it's going to be 50 pixels 50 pixels and let's reload it again yes 50 pixels is too good okay so we can see this radius it's a very very beautiful radius so let's create another one video up here we are going to create an another one video for that what we are going to do means let's uh create one space here yes but i can go to uh our youtube channel and i can go inside my youtube channel and inside this what i'm going to do means that i can add one of our video which is a five roll app okay so i can click share and uh, click embed and copy it and let I can go to Visual Studio Code. So we can see that uh, frame border, right? Frame border is going to be 10 as you, as I say, in the last video and this video, iframe video. So then what I'm going to do means that I'm going to keep a style for this, okay? Style is equal to, okay? Style is going to double. Inside so this style, what I'm going to do means, oh, it's style, okay? S T Y L E style is equal to so it's going to margin okay margin from left from left it is uh 10 pixels from left it is 10 pixels so let i can go to our website and if we saw means what will happen yes we can see uh two videos and we can see one some spaces here okay so let add one uh description for our channel so let's go to our channel youtube channel and let's go to our youtube channel and go to about so if you you can see some description here let i can copy it so let i can if i copy it means copy with description word itself so let i can create one paragraph here so i can create one paragraph yes inside this paragraph i'm going to keep, keep this okay also uh in the first description after description what is going to do means it's going to break the lines okay 
break the line. Again, after this forever, it is going to break the line. So it is a BR tag. Again, after this, uh, this board text is going to break the line. Okay, it is going to break the line. Also, for the, after the store, it is going to break the line. Okay, after this, you can, it is going to break the line. Okay, also, uh, before this, it is going to add another one to break the line. Also, before this, also, it is going to have, again break the line. So, let's see what is happening now. Okay, let's go to our visuals, I mean, our website. So let's reload and see. Yes, we can see the description, right? So we can see the description successfully. Also, it's a uh, background is red color, tomato color. Why? Because we have kept the her wear tomato color, right? Can we we may keep this background color as white or uh, we can do nothing, okay? So also uh, it can be tomato color itself. So this is, this is our overall code. Also, we, if we reload and see means we can see this our videos and we can see a a marquee tag. And we can see a description, and we can see our two videos, and we can see our channel description. Uh, this is our overall uh, codes for our our website. Okay, so thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and give a like for our video. And don't forget to uh, share with your friends and families. Okay, so let's meet in our next video. Okay.